Hey guys, so this is the Elite Screens Sable Series. So this is a 100 inch diagonal screen. I kind of have this in our extra kind of over the garage room here that we're using for kind of our little movie theater room. So I actually don't have this fixed to the wall, although you do get mounting hardware. Uh, this has kind of this plush velvety edge and uh, this helps absorb kind of any overshoot from the projector as well. So that definitely works because yeah, if you're not completely lined up perfectly square on there, if there's a little bit of light on that edge, it does help absorb that definitely. But yeah, this is a very good quality product. I've used this with uh, multiple projectors in here. And it, like I said, you can mount this up. You do kind of have to do some installation with this. On the back in here, there are springs and you kind of put the actual uh, screen on here. So you can kind of see there is some installation. You get kind of the hardware and there's directions and everything, but you end up actually uh, fitting the screen onto this. And then at the end, you kind of affix the velvet kind of border. And uh, like I said, if you choose to, you have that mount where you can actually mount it up on the wall as well. But yeah, it's uh, this kind of gray color. So obviously your projector is going to do a lot of the work here and uh, really dictate your picture quality too. This is just like a 1080p, actually kind of budget projector that I've got thrown up here right now. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, you know, as far as like light bleeding and stuff up at the top here, there's really none. Uh, you kind of, you know, do your best to dial in your picture. And then uh, around the edges, you know, like I said, that velvet actually does a pretty good job then. Um, you don't see any bleeding really onto the wall or anything. And yeah, I'm very happy with uh, the quality of the screen though. I think it's a great projector screen. So I do recommend when you are setting this up, have two people handy for kind of putting the springs together and kind of stretching the screen over the frame and all that stuff. It'll definitely go a long way having a little bit of help with that. Uh, it did take uh, about an hour, hour and a half, I'd say, for two of us to do it. Yeah, it takes a little bit of installation, but then the end product looks pretty cool. There's something about having those edges there built in where you kind of frame the screen. It makes it definitely look a lot better quality, a little bit more higher end. We throw the light back on there, but yeah, I like it a lot and uh, I would recommend it if you're looking into it. I think it's a good option. Try it out and see.